And now let me read a segment from the book, Santa Claus Magic. I'm just going to read a little bit from the introduction. This book is about getting that fat Christmas guy to give you the stuff you actually want. I'm sure you know the guy in modern times as depicted as dressing in red goes back by the name of Santa Claus or Saint Nick, Saint Nicholas, Father Christmas or simply Santa. I know that to many the idea of Santa Claus being real is a joke and certainly not something that any real occultist would think about. But the truth is that even in the occult there are things hidden in plain sight. And this is that if enough people believe in something then it becomes real. In fact is real. It means that Santa Claus as we think of him is a mere thought form, something manifested by our belief. However, if we had the idea that this thought form, Santa, will give you a Ferrari for you on a Christmas day, you may be right, but more likely not. The thing is that the thought form Santa has a purpose because he and sometimes others, elves, are what we are thought of that things are supposed to look like. They appear to for us. This is, a, this is a, its strongest on Christmas day, or around that time. But there is bad news. This Santa usually does not bother to live for anything, he is merely seen darting around, looking as if he is the living presence. That is right, the damn fraud has been building his image using other people's cash. Thereby the presence he gets the credit. And that's the book, Santa Claus Magic.